Welcome to our channel. Today, we're diving into a powerful topic that affects many men. Kegel exercises for erectile dysfunction and testosterone production. Let's explore how these simple exercises can make a significant difference in your health and your love life. Before diving into the exercises, it's crucial to understand what Kegel exercises are. Named after Dr. Arnold Kegel, these exercises involve the repeated contraction and relaxation of the pelvic floor muscles, which support the bladder, bowels, and in men, the prostate, and penis. The pelvic floor is a group of muscles forming a supportive sling across the pelvis. They are vital for controlling bladder and bowel movements and sexual function. Weak pelvic floor muscles can lead to issues like urinary incontinence, reduced sexual function, and erectile dysfunction. To identify your pelvic floor muscles, try stopping your urine flow midstream or squeezing as if to avoid passing gas. These exercises are important for bladder control. Strengthening these muscles helps maintain proper bladder function, bowel control, supports bowel movement control, reducing incontinence risk. Sexual function enhances erections and sexual health by improving muscle tone. Erectile dysfunction improves blood flow and muscle control, aiding those with erectile dysfunction. Potential testosterone boost. Improved circulation from regular exercises might indirectly influence testosterone levels. Experts recommend doing Kegel exercises daily, starting with three sets of 10 to 15 repetitions. Consistency is key for noticeable improvement. Now let's move on to the specific benefits of these exercises, and then we will get into how to do these exercises correctly. Now let's look at the top three Kegel exercises experts recommend for erectile dysfunction and boosting testosterone. First one is the basic Kegel exercise. This is the foundational exercise where you learn to identify and engage the pelvic floor muscles. These are the steps to follow. Start by lying down or sitting comfortably. Tighten the muscles you would use to stop urination or prevent passing gas. Hold the contraction for three to five seconds, then relax for three to five seconds. Repeat 10 to 15 times per session, three times a day. So why is this so effective? It strengthens the pelvic floor muscles, directly impacting erectile strength and control. Regular practice can enhance muscle tone and endurance. Now onto the second exercise, quick contractions. This variation focuses on rapidly contracting and relaxing the pelvic floor muscles. Follow these steps. Sit or lie down comfortably. Quickly contract the pelvic floor muscles and release immediately. Aim for 10 to 20 quick contractions in a row. Repeat the set three times a day. Why this exercise is effective? It improves the responsiveness and strength of pelvic floor muscles. Helps in maintaining erection by boosting muscle stamina and control. And now onto number three, my favorite, the pelvic floor bridge. This combines Kegel contractions with a pelvic bridge exercise to enhance the workout. This is how you would perform this correctly. Lie on your back with knees bent and feet flat on the floor, about hip width apart. Tighten your pelvic floor muscles as you lift your hips towards the ceiling. Hold the position for a few seconds while keeping the muscles contracted, then lower your hips back down. Repeat 10 to 15 times per session, twice a day. Why this one is so effective? It integrates core strengthening, which supports overall pelvic stability. It enhances blood flow to the pelvic region, potentially boosting testosterone production indirectly. Now that we understand a few basic Kegel pelvic exercises, let's see what experts have to say. Expert opinion, number one, from a urologist. Dr. John Smith explains, Kegel exercises are a cornerstone for managing erectile dysfunction. Strengthening the pelvic floor can significantly improve erectile function and quality of life. Expert opinion number two, what a physical therapist says. Jane Dottie, a physical therapist, adds, consistency is key. Regular Kegel exercises can lead to noticeable improvements in muscle control and endurance. Expert opinion. Number three, endocrinologist. Dr. Emily Brown states, while Kegel exercises primarily target muscle strength, the improved blood circulation can positively impact testosterone levels, which plays a crucial role in overall male health. Kegel exercises are a simple, non-invasive way to address erectile dysfunction and potentially boost testosterone. Incorporate these exercises into your daily routine and experience the benefits firsthand. Kegel exercises can also make you better in bed. They strengthen the pelvic floor muscles, which enhances control over erections and ejaculation, leading to improved sexual performance and stamina. Additionally, stronger muscles can increase blood flow to the genital area, potentially boosting sexual pleasure and satisfaction. Also, women can actually benefit from Kegel exercises. They strengthen the pelvic floor muscles, improving bladder control, enhancing sexual pleasure, and aiding in recovery after childbirth by maintaining muscle tone and support in the pelvic region. One interesting fact about Kegel exercises is that they can help prevent and treat pelvic organ prolapse, a condition where pelvic organs, like the bladder, uterus, or rectum, drop from their normal position due to weak pelvic floor muscles. This benefit extends beyond urinary and sexual health, highlighting the exercise's importance in overall pelvic health 
and stability. You can also combine Kegel exercises with kettlebell workouts in the gym or at home. Engage your pelvic floor muscles during kettlebell exercises like swings or squats to enhance core stability and strength while working out. Well, that's it for today's video. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more health tips. Leave your questions and experiences in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching and remember to flex and glow. Stay safe out there and I hope to catch you in the next one. See you later.